So today, let's see can we use rocks in a hydroponic system as inert media. So, generally, the most important thing is to be considered here is that there should be some properties of inert media. Usually, and use this inert media in a hydroponic system because of its two properties. The first property of inert media is that it does not contain any self-nutrient source. Generally, nutrient-wise, it is very inert because it does not contain any type of nutrients. This is the first requirement of inert media. The second requirement or property for this inert media is that we need to see how easy it can absorb water and it should retain and make it available for the roots. So this second property of inert media is very important because it let us decide that of what kind of inert media we should use. If you see around the market and survey which is the most used inert media, you will find cocoa peat, which is generally used in the hydroponic system. Generally, cocoa peat is itself an inert medium. It does not contain any inert value. It absorbs the water very fast and holds the water in it for a long time. In the Oasis Cube, also you will find out the same properties that it absorbs water and then hold it. If we consider rock, comparing this all inert media. This property is not found in rock because rock neither absorbs water nor release the water. So until your rock is dipped in the water, it will be wet due to water, but can it absorb the water? No. So after some time, can it release the water for the roots? So for this reason, we do not use rock in the hydroponic system. Instead of rocks, we use different inert media such as cocoa peat, Generally, rocks as inert media are cost-effective, but if your water flow is continuous then only you can use rock as a support system, but not as an inert media. Learn more interesting stuff about hydroponics with us. You can also learn more about setting up your commercially successful hydroponic farm with us. Thank you for watching this video. Don't forget to subscribe to this channel to get upcoming videos on hydroponic growing to become commercially successful in this domain. Also, consider pressing a like button on this video. It will help us understand should we continue making more videos like this or not. See you in the next video with another interesting topic and hidden secrets of hydroponics.